the noble district suffered just as badly. This is what the devil golem is capable of. I might be able to save Toy if I use my arm. But what if that means this happens again somewhere else? Is saving him just to boost my own ego really the right thing to do? Tell me, what do you think? Well done, noticing my presence. It wasn't easy, by the way. And? What are you so worried about now? You must save Toya, that's all there is to it. I want to save him, but for the sake of one person, is it really okay to sacrifice everything else? What do you mean? I'm worried that I can't control my arm. I don't want to cause devastation like this anywhere else. I see. I'm impressed that you can express such complex feelings. Could you say this in front of Toya? No, of course not. How could I? I couldn't even say it to Mikado. I'd know how he'd react. He'd get all angry and start squealing at me like a pig. No, he wouldn't. What? He'd just be disappointed. Like I am now. Yeah, maybe. Well then, this is farewell. I don't think we'll meet again. Wait a minute. Disappointed? Who cares what you think, weirdo? Well, anyway, I'm exhausted. Back to the castle for today. My room is on the second floor. I think. Rygar. Lord Rygar, please reconsider. The Knights and London City need you, Lord Rygar. Please, come back as Knight Captain. I quit the Knights, if you recall. Yet we are all in agreement. We want you to come back. Please, only you can lead the reborn London Knights. I'm sorry, but I must refuse. Don't say that, please. Why won't you rejoin us, Lord Rygar? Because you don't need me. Combine your strengths and you can do anything, with or without me. Farewell. Lord Rygar! Do you truly not care about the knights anymore? Oh, that was pretty cold of him. Rygar? Oh, you're back, Atsuma. Good work down in the city. Yeah. Can I ask you something? What? I saw you just now, actually. Why don't you become captain again? Those guys, they, they, they really seem to need you. Atsuma. Yes? That which each person holds dear is different. One person cannot hold enough power to protect everything. 
This may sound harsh, but sometimes letting something go is vital in order to hold something else dear. That's what I've come to believe. For you, that's protecting Kareen then? Correct. Supporting the country as the Knight Captain is one thing. But for me, protecting Lady Kareen is even more important than that. Even if this country were to be destroyed and Lady Kareen became an ordinary person, I would do nothing differently. As you know, Lady Kareen is reckless. Without complete freedom, I could not keep up with her. I see. Tell me, Atsuma, what do you hold dear? Me? Well, I guess saving Toya is the most important thing to me at the moment. Saving Toya. I wonder why I lost sight of that. It's so important to me, yet I let it go so easily. No matter how strong your intent, it can weaken with time. If people start doubting, they can lose sight of themselves. The world is full of temptations, after all. You must remain vigilant at all times, yet you cannot afford to become too self-absorbed, for that route leads to misfortune as well. Life is too short to try and take back something important once it is lost. You'll be reduced to regrets, and regrets only bring on more regrets, and so it continues. You're right. Thank you, Rygar. I feel a lot better after talking to you. I'm going to save Toya. No matter what anyone says, I believe in him. Very well. Then let me tell you something else that may interest you. Oh yeah? I was going to keep this to myself if I thought you weren't fully committed. But I have an idea how you can learn to control your arm. What? Really? Go to Kyoto City. Kyoto City? You've heard the name, I'm sure. It lies far to the west of London City. I traveled there to train. I heard a story at a village I stopped in. It told of a secret art that quells a wild heart and unleashes true potential. If you can learn this technique, you might be able to bring your arm under control. So did you master it, Rygar? I was called back to London City soon after I learned of it. Who knows what Lady Corrine may do if I'm not at her side after all. I hear you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to stop all this pointless pondering. It doesn't suit me after all. Good idea. I'm just going to do what I can to save Toya. If there's any chance if my arm can help, I'll do what I have to. You've made your mind up then. Yeah! I'm going to Kyoto and I'm going to learn that secret art. If that will save Toya, I'll do whatever it takes. Oh. I think I need to eat something first, though. Huh. Prepare for battle. Eat well and sleep well, my friend. Right then, off I go. Which way was Kyoto City? Well, I guess I have to pass through the castle gate first. From here on out, I'm going it alone. So I need to keep my wits about me. I didn't go and say goodbye to everyone, but it'll just make it harder to leave if I do. This is for the best. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, London City. Bye-bye, London City. Huh? Farewell, London City. Huh? See you again, London City. Oh, uh, what? Oh, wait! Why are you guys here? Why shouldn't we be? Rygar told me we'd be leaving in the morning. He never can keep things like this to himself, you know. Right, Rygar? As you say. And who says? Rygar, why'd you have to tell them? I'm sorry, Atsuma. I don't recall you telling me to keep anything a secret. That's dirty. Adults play dirty. I see. Do you know exactly where you're going? Uh... Kareen, what about you? You're the princess. Shouldn't you oversee the reconstruction of this place? London has excellent staff in the castle. They'll be fine running things here. The reconstruction is proceeding smoothly, too. Anyway, 
I haven't punched you yet. Do you think you could just waltz out of here? You don't get off that easily. Uh, so Rygar. If Lady Corrine is going, then I have no choice in the matter. Okay, but Yuki. Me? That's easy. I just want to be with you. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> You're just trying to stop him running out on his debts, aren't you? You're like a bailiff or something. Poor Atsuma. What? A bailiff? Hey, I, I want to... I mean, I want Atsuma to... I'm sorry. Are you saying something? Stop mumbling and speak up. You're just a bratty little kid, aren't you? I'm not a kid. Blech. Only kids say meh. You've proven my point. I never said meh, so meh. Well, meh, back to you. <laughs> Time to go, Atsuma. Okay.
I'll show you what I'm made of. Eat this! Uh -oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. 